Balloon is really the star. Yeah. Alright guys, we are do we're starting a new series where we do certain myths and unveil them. As you see my friend here is just about to fill out this water balloon. We're gonna test some experiments with this in the past in the next few episodes, right? Yep. Okay, got three times it well do one experiment. One of our favorites. Can a water balloon hit a human? Uh, but not burst. Hey, don't hit me! Come on, I'm <laughs> oh, come on! Toby here, our dear friend, is going to be the test dummy. <laughs> hey, why me? <laughs> mm. Okay, what I'm gonna do is bend down and turn around and turn back onto me. No over by the hockey net because I <laughs> gotta throw this on your back, okay? <laughs> here. Yep. Okay, guys, he's a bit of fire. Let's watch. It doesn't even burst. Jared, oh. go back a little bit farther. With even more, fo with a little more force. Ah. I missed him, but never Try burst it when again. it failed the impact. It didn't even burst. It didn't even have a little tear. This thing is modeling clay. Just look. I just never you didn't burst. You're lucky, aren't you? Yeah. Let's try it one more time. Oh. You go all the way back there, and then you try it with a little more force oh. overhand. It's not gonna work. Oh, he burst oh, it. Miss. You're gonna well, burst that. You have it. If you're close range. It will not burst. So make sure you get big water balloons. Because in, that's Wait, the only way. Wait, we're not done here yet. We need to test the big water balloon. Oh, uh, okay. Let's test the larger one. Let's go, Bert. Let's go get another water balloon, a bigger one. I believe that that even for a little bit close, we'll still burst it. That's my hypothesis. Can you be the dummy this time? No, Elwood. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, I get wet. Who cares? <laughs> well, he being the dummy. Well, too bad. It's all my first step sold. Of, of experiment, of, of the super duper cool model. You just gotta get that on. Get it on, boy. Hey, Jared. If this Drop experiment on. gets me wet, can I soak you? Oh. <laughs> Don't worry, my water hole is regular like that, so. Oh my god. Is it big? Oh, it's a little bigger. Is it cold? Yep. Oh! Well, not really. It's caught him in between. Like the water you swim in, Albert? Oh. Like the water you would swim in. Sure. Alright. Okay, we'll just try it a little close, okay? To see what will happen. I believe that it'll burst even. No! Oh my goodness. That's only really close, though. So. I bit back further. Missed. You missed. So we probably if we threw there, it probably would still be. I think that was flat. It would have bursted if we did hit him because we already rehearsed it before, before yesterday and it didn't really burst. Nope. But when we did the big one, it did burst. So let's continue. Let's say let's continue after this episode by saying a statement. And a good day for me because I didn't get wet. Yeah, larger water balloons are, are, are easier to burst than la smaller ones, and if you're a greater distance away, the impact will be stronger, which therefore will burst the water balloon much easier. And, if you have any ideas for our next shows, then well, you can please give comment us, below. Please comment, and we will do your ideas. Mm -hmm. Goodbye, YouTube. It could be any ideas. It doesn't have to be about water Wait. balloons. It Wait. could be hockey or... Anything like that that's possible to do. Wait! Anything that's possible for a 10 year old and a and a 13 year old to do. Hey, wait! If this involves get me, somebody getting soaked, do it have to be me? Yes, it's more mm, funny. No, oh, this is not gonna involve people getting soaked. Yeah! Okay, well. And this concludes it for our first episode. Wait, what's you doing next time? What you doing with that? And clear. Seriously, what you doing with that?